Welcome to the Tax Slayer Bowl as part of Capital One Bowl Mania from a chilly Jacksonville, Florida, and Everbank Field. We have a matchup pitting the ACC versus the SEC. The Louisville Cardinals have won their final three games of the regular season, trying to go out on style as they take the field here today against eight and four Mississippi State out of the SEC. One of the more dynamic dual threat athletes at the quarterback position that we have ever seen. You've seen the video game jukes with his feet. You've seen the electric plays, but in my opinion, He's had as good of a season and stats back it up, if not better than his Heisman campaign for what he's been able to do inside the pocket, developing as a passer. He's been unbelievable. The numbers have been sensational each of the last two years. This year, the completion percentage went up. The pass yards about the same. He was asked this week, why are you playing in this game? You've got teammates that are sitting it, sitting it out. You may have a pro future in front of you. He said, I owe it to my teammates who have played hurt all season long. Second in the country in total yardage. He's got Reggie Bonifon with them in the backfield. And Lamar wants to throw over the middle. Trying to find one of his big tight ends. On the read, Jackson will keep it. Plenty of room straight up the middle for him, and he's got a first down. Five-man rush. Jackson got hit, escapes, and here he goes with his feet. And Lamar Jackson can do just that. The danger of blitzing him is if you miss your lane. Defensive coordinator at Michigan is calling the defense today for Mississippi State. Jackson shovels it out incomplete, trying to find Dez Fitzpatrick. Last year at this time, he had just finished the Louisiana 5A state championship game at the Superdome. Thompson in a collapsing pocket, able to fire it for a first down to his tight end, Jordan Thomas. This guy is a load, 6'5", 280. Check, look to the side, make sure they're in the right play, and keep it on. Harris Williams is the running back. He finds the hole, and he slips his way through to play well. On second and eight, Thompson takes it straight ahead. Harris Williams, touchdown, Mississippi State from five yards out. And that was quick. Chris Mann, a walk-on SEC All-Freshman team. And whipped on that one. On his first kickoff attempt, it's recovered by Corey Reed. Lamar Jackson and Louisville are going to have fantastic field position. That front four and Jeffrey Simmons, number 94. What well, makes the Cardinals so unpredictable is on a down like this, they can also run it. Third and nine, over the middle and wide open. Jalen Smith for a first down. Parmy Seth Dawkins for a first down for Louisville. Here comes the blitz. Jackson shoved back, still able to complete it. It'll be shy of the first down to Jalen Smith. Mississippi State changes personnel to match. Day Williams in the backfield. Lamar looking for a big one. Max protection, he'll dump it out to Kamari Averett. And Averett, the tight end, has it inside the 10 for Louisville. You got man coverage here at the top of your screen, playing off on the inside receiver, and pressed on the outside. Mark Jackson sidearms one to the goal line. Touchdown Louisville and Charles Stanberry. A five yard strike. Five wide and an empty fact. backfield. Thompson is a fantastic runner, and this was a designed run all the way. Good blocking on the edge. He is fast and he'll hurt you. Thompson will run it again. And this time he goes straight ahead to pick up the first down. We'll return to the field. Kylan Hill in the backfield. They will hand it off to Eris Williams, and he's got a big game straight up the middle. Into Louisville territory on a 20-yard sprint. The freshman fires complete. Hill, the freshman from Columbus. A devastating game in many ways for Mississippi State when they lost their starting quarterback early in the first quarter. Thompson finds the edge. Runs through two Cardinals, takes it inside the 10. Keaton Thompson with a gain of 24. It was an offense that averaged 48 points a game his senior year at Landry Walker in New Orleans. Here's Thompson, the freshman. He is in. Touchdown, Mississippi State. A bruising 14 yard run.
the slant, and it's batted down. It's a fantastic point, but remember, this is a Louisville defense missing some key players. They're missing the best pass rusher and their best cover corner. Thompson shifts in the pocket and complete to the 40. From the NFL, decided with help from his family that he would skip the bowl game. Complete just shy of the marker and a, marker and a wrestle for a first down once again. Dorian Etheridge and these linebackers to make plays. Three man rush here. Thompson has running room if he wants it. A shake move on the edge. And then power. And Keaton Thompson takes it for eight. Hitting the holes hard. Great perimeter blocking. He's making good decisions. It looks very good so far. And he takes off on this third down and is able to find. How do the personnel here at Mississippi State fit what you plan on doing in the future? It fits great. You know, the, the success of our offense is predicated on our ability to run the ball successfully. Mississippi, Mississippi State certainly did that last year, and they're doing it today. Mississippi State, freshman making his very first start after Nick Fitzgerald was lost to injury. And Thompson pressured and will be taken down. We got a lot of guys we're familiar with. Most of that staff was my coaches at Vanderbilt. Are you able to turn your or, or take your coaching hat off for a second, be a fan of these guys? Uh, it, it's weird. This is my <laughs> as we talked about yesterday. Because you're not calling second, plays no, right now. This is my now, second you're... time at the tax layer, but when I haven't coached out of time, so <laughs> well, the highest percentages in college football. You sit on 11 of 12 from 42, and Chrisman misses for just the second time this season in Louisville. Lamar Jackson able to win that Heisman Trophy behind the offensive line a year ago. He's going play action here. We'll jump back to that in a moment. On first and 15, he completes it to Jalen Smith, and that's good for a first down. He stayed down the sideline before losing to football. Is a sign of great coaching and a sign of want to by the individuals. Last five games, they've averaged 43 rush attempts, just 29 through the air. Jackson rolls and skips one to his intended receiver. Knocking off Kentucky last night, that was another thriller. Here's third and five. Complete to Smith. He's got a first down, and a stiff arm will get him a few more. Lamar Jackson keeps it. Lamar Jackson finds the end zone again. Touchdown from 13 yards out. That's just silly. That is just unbelievable. This play, this play should be dead right here. But only Lamar Jackson will split two guys like that, make another one miss. Passing in the night, Sermon left Mississippi State, ended up at Louisville. Sermon, uh, pardon me, Grantham left Louisville, ended up at Mississippi State. And his defense comes up with a big stop there. It's a loss of two as D. Smith. The SEC can make up ground, Pac-12. Not a good start. But not just one of seven, but some blowout losses yeah. for the Pac-12. Here's the reverse. And they want to throw it. Reggie Bonifant, who started his career as a quarterback, got swallowed up by Jonathan Abram, who read it from the get-go. Louisville third in the nation in plays of 20 yards or longer. longer. So second and 17. Well, it is a concern now. Lamar trying to lose him. Ad-libbing all the way back to the end zone. But third and long here, I imagine, the screen or quick throw. Pocket holds, deep ball, intercepted by Mississippi State. Mark McLaurin looking for blockers. Back to the 20. And that ends a long streak for Lamar Jackson. There was 114 consecutive passes with a pick, without a pick. And this one has the Bulldogs in great field position. Jermaine Washington, 15 top of your screen. That's a mismatch. Thompson got blasted at the line of scrimmage by Stacy Thomas. No gain. This is now third and goal. Here comes the blitz. Thompson has to get rid of it in a hurry. And inside the 10 goes Jesse Jackson on a gain of eight. And he fits it in. Throw behind, and he threw another pick. Intercepted by Mississippi State, their second takeaway of the game. Cameron Dantzler, the freshman, with his first. Kylan Hill changes direction and pays the price. He's taken down by Trayvon Young. Here in the second quarter near halftime. Pressure from the edge coming. Thompson steps up and fires. It is hauled in 
by Reggie Todd. Thompson will leave the pocket and throw on the run. He finds Todd again. Reggie Todd lost the football. And the Cardinals have recovered. Tremaine Washington finds it. Get some momentum with the drive here before half. Lamar Jackson with a minute to go in the half. Picks up maybe two. I Reese thanks. 41 seconds from the half and counting. Lamar Jackson straight ahead. Lamar Jackson in a foot race looking for a block. The Heisman Trophy winner has Green in front of him. And he's tracked down from behind the set of Louisville inside the 10 on a 75-yard run. This one's hippie. Man coverage bringing blitz. Jackson shovels wide. Touchdown, Jalen Smith. The improv act remains impressive. It's an 11-yard pass to Smith. You smile at that. Not much you can say. Greg Knox, tip his hat. And the Cardinals of Louisville have a 21-17 lead at the break. Stay tuned for the Mercedes-Benz Halftime Report. Reese, Smack Brown, and Jonathan Vilma from Pasadena after this. Thompson will hand it off on first down. Williams comes out for a play on first down. And they go right back to that ground game, and Kylan Hill, and the freshman has a first down of his own. He's that player again. He's who we expected. With the sun out on second and 12. Thompson incomplete. No flag. And Peter Sermon says he's had a great week of bowl practice. Thompson following Kylan Hill. Good block from the running back. Been hard to get a hand on Lamar Jackson today, as electric as ever. Yeah, one reason I thought they may actually go for that fourth down there is you want to keep the ball out of Lamar Jackson's hands as much as possible. Like I said, he's had some eyes, good movement, accuracy outside the pocket, making people miss. A couple interceptions in there, but he's played a lot of football. This guy not worried about bouncing back with the confidence. And you see it here as he broke off the longest run of his career to set up the late score. And then that's an artist at work. Nickel defense on the field for Mississippi State. They come up to make the stop. It's Gary Green. And on the ground again. We'll step out. That way as well. First team all SEC defensive lineman. Mississippi State has two of them for the first time ever. Jackson gets out of there. Lamar Jackson staying alive. Somehow, he only loses two. He should have lost 12 after being sandwiched deep in the backfield. If you can't tackle him. <laughs> it's true. You can dedicate one guy to shadow Lamar Jackson. Oh, Miles mishandles the punt. Louisville's all over it. And the Cardinals will have it at the 20-yard line. LaMarcus Thomas comes up with it for the cards. You start passing, you start opening up 45-degree angles for Lamar to take off and run. Great job by this front of doing just that. They fake the screen, and Jackson, third down three. Jackson can't escape that one. Montez Sweat ends up bringing him down after Fletcher Adams forced him upfield. It's a loss of seven. Third sack of the game for Mississippi State. And he yanks it. Some shifting with the wide receivers. Thompson looking over the middle, going for a deep ball, a wobbler that is bobbled and incomplete. Reggie Todd was waiting for that one to come down. His name populates not only the Louisville record book, and they've had some fantastic quarterbacks there, but also the ACC record book. Here comes a corner blitz. Jackson stayed on his feet for a moment. And the third brings him down. It was after he dropped the ball and dribbled it right back up to scoop it up. Mississippi State brought pressure from the field there. Jonathan Abram, the safety, almost had a big play, but Lamar was able to pick up the ball and make sure a bad play didn't get any worse. Eight second-half snaps for Louisville, four sacks for Mississippi State. Lamar Jackson directing the offense. You want to work back to the quarterback and work with the quarterback, and Lamar's been so good this year at keeping his eyes downfield. Woo! Big hit. 
On third down, Talando Cleveland took down Jalen Smith after a gain of five. I wanted to go hit at 17 at Sawgrass, but we had to meet with coaches and stuff. Eton Thompson, the freshman, fires, intercepted by Louisville. Chucky Williams with the takeaway. English one-time defensive coordinator at Louisville under Steve Trackthorpe. Big run, Bonifon. He gets spun around after picking up a first down. On first down, Jackson dumps it off. Complete to Jalen Smith. And you could add up my stats from Pop Warner football <laughs> to, to through my career. I'm not sure I had that number. He's a heck of a player. Cards have struggled on third down. End zone. Incomplete. 23-yard attempt for Blanton Creepy. And he pulls this one, but it just sneaks through. Two freshman quarterback in there. Thompson hands it off. And a first down run and power. Watch practice, hang out in the locker room with the guys and got very comfortable with this team. Deep ball. Thompson looking for many, and it is incomplete. Here's the tight end, Jordan Thomas. Gives it to Logan Cook. And Cook will let it dribble down all the way inside to the one-yard line. Oh, they almost got him. Day Williams able to get it out of the end zone. Extra DB on the field now for Mississippi State, second down 11. To the outside. Seth Dawkins. And the defense can't overload pre-snap one side or the other. Day Williams is the running back. On third and one, Lamar will keep it, finds the edge, and cuts it back. He already has one 75-yard run today, and he rips that one off for 15. Incomplete intercepted again. Mark McLaurin with his second pick of the game. And Mississippi State's defense brings them right back into this thing. Second and seven for the freshman from New Orleans at quarterback. And he will take it himself. Deton Thompson has a first down. And he takes it down to the five. Interim head coach, ninth season in Mississippi State, was Dan Mullen's running backs coach. Thompson takes a snap straight ahead. Gets popped as he gets to the line and he's in. Touchdown run for Keaton Thompson. His second of the game. Cardinals really struggling on third down. Just three of 12. And they'll complete that one and move the chains. You can't tell. You can't look in his gut because you can't see it. Straight up the middle, Malik Williams. Loading his legs, that's why he gets out so quick. Second and four. Jackson's got it, following his blocker, and he gets on second and ten. Bonifon. Back in that pistol formation, trying to balance up this Mississippi State defense. Bonifon. Stopped short after picking up one. McLaurin's having a heck of a game. He'll keep it, trying to win a foot race. Hurdles a guy and gets to the first down marker and a couple more. Lamar Jackson, second 15. Jackson gets through a hole. At some point, got to get back to your roots. And this Todd Grantham, former Todd Grantham defense, used to bring in pressure. Over the middle. Incomplete. Abram, 31-yard attempt. For Blanton Creaky, he's one of two today. He's been pulling them left, and that one stays straight. More than it looked, though. Good to see him walk off and give a thumbs up. Here comes the nickel blitz again for Louisville. Mississippi State picks it up. Thompson going deep. He's got a guy, but overthrown by a yard and a half. Third down seven. Four-man rush. Thompson hit as he throws. Complete for a first down. And Jamal Couch has it into Louisville territory. Quarterback keeps it. Keaton Thompson 
First down. Dragon dudes with him, and he takes it. Thompson gives it up to Eris Williams this time. Fifth leading rusher in the SEC. Thompson. Gets popped at the 15. Saw them in practice working this matchup. He's 6'4. Corner's under six foot out there, but Thompson takes it to the five. Steps through to the goal line. He is down at the one. A flag back at the 14. All side. Oh. Defense. Tyler's a fine. Quarterback lead. Hill will lead the way. Thompson's in again. His third rushing touchdown. And Mississippi State's back in front. It ain't, it ain't broke. Don't fix it. But he's got a chance now with three and a half minutes left to cap this off and only add to his legacy here at Louisville. Second quarterback with 150 yards plus in two bowl games. The other was Vince Young, who in 06 did it against Ron English in Michigan in the Rose Bowl. English now the D.C. for Mississippi State today. Lamar Jackson straight ahead. Just tripped. Would you go deep here? I wouldn't. Keep doing what you're doing. On second and one. It is intercepted by Mississippi State. McLaurin's got his third pick of the game. I'm gonna say keep doing what you're doing. Run the football. This game pitted a top 10 defense against a top three offense as Harris Williams breaks it to the outside. Bulldogs have converted half of the third downs today. He will run it, and he is stopped short. Will roll, now cuts back. They take him down in the backfield, and the plan backfires for Mississippi State. Fantastic field position for the Cardinals and Lamar Jackson after the sack. No timeouts for Lamar Jackson in Louisville. 139 to go. Jackson takes off, trying to find the sideline. He's been sacked four times in the second half. Here comes the blitz. Jackson's got to get rid of it. He can't, and he goes down. Fifth sack of the half. Jeffrey Simmons and JT Gray. Now, Tom, it, you got four downs here, so you only need half. You don't try to get it all in this one play. Under a minute to go. Jackson pressured again. Down again. Great job beating man on man. Line slid to the right. Now you're thinking, got to get past the sticks. Something deep. Three-man rush. Lamar Jackson over the middle. Caught. First down. Clock will stop to move the chain. 16 seconds left. Clock is running. They won't spike it. Jackson, long down the sideline. Incomplete. And five seconds remain. Seven DBs inside the 15-yard line and they, for Mississippi State. They might not go jump ball here. They might try to get some laterals. Movement. Ball start. Offense. Number 73. Five yards. To your point, there second is down. 40 yards of green between the ten defensive linemen and available. the secondary. The clock was not running. There will still be six seconds left in the game. Lamar will roll left. Now he's got to go back right. He's in trouble. We'll let it go on the run. He's got the distance. It is batted away. Mississippi State survives. Jonathan Abram knocks it down for the Bulldogs. That is the end of the game. This has been one remarkable bowl season and 23rd ranked Mississippi State under interim head coach Greg Knox finds a win against Lamar Jackson in Louisville. It came down to the wire.